All right, so my skunk friends are back living under my shed. Got to get rid of them. So I'm trying to brainstorm for uh, a better method of, of uh, removing them and relocating them because the current method of uh, disposition just doesn't leave me feeling good. Um, so uh, I got this new method um, and I'm hoping to show you and see if it works. Uh, it's a very simple method and hopefully you can get rid of a skunk without getting sprayed. All right, so what I have here is I have a heart trap. I guess you've all seen them before. You gotta lift up on this release arm, pull, pull the, uh, the gate open and lock it in over here to keep the door open. So when the animal comes in to grab the food, it steps on this plate and boom, it's trapped inside. That's great. But here lies the problem. If you catch a skunk, if you see that it's wide open from all angles, and if you approach it, you're probably, and if you approach it, you're probably getting sprayed. Uh, most likely getting sprayed because I, uh, I've i already gotten sprayed four times. Even trying the, uh, the trusted method on, on YouTube of covering it up with a um, blanket, it don't help. So here's, here's, a, here's a little trick that uh, I'm hoping works perfectly fine. So you can set, you can set the door either before or after, but what I got here, and you've all seen this, is a simple leaf bag that you get from your local recycle center or you buy from the box stores. And uh, they're the perfect size. Kind of just open it up. I'm gonna stand it up. If you have another person to help you, that's, that's even better. So I'm just going to put it in. Little, a little hole inside for the handle over here. And that's it, folks. Lift it up, turn it up, and you can get your finger in here and lock it in. And it's ready to rock and roll. As soon as the animal goes in there, I can't trip it now because the bag's in my way. As soon as the animal goes in, whammo. You are now covered on all sides. Take them away, and you don't have to have the guilt of uh, of getting rid of them in another method. All right, hope this helps. So here I have a skunk and a rather large one trapped in this bag. I had it set up over here, it's just sitting on these blocks, so it's nice and square. And that's the hole that he he or she dug under my shed. And this is the trail cam that ran out of video because it was so windy last night. Every little thing was setting it off. So it kind of ran out of uh, card space by the time he or she walked into here. But it's in there and I'm going to release it.